August 19th, Baltimore sees alarming spike in bats with rabies. August 19th, violent strain of hand, foot, and mouth disease ravages Vietnam. 81 deaths reported this year. August 19th, tragedy is as falling stage crushes music fans. Five people have been killed and more than 70 injured after a violent storm struck an open-air music festival in Belgium. August 19th, Phoenix engulfed by the third giant dust storm in less than two months. A giant wall of dust rolled through the Phoenix area on Thursday for the third time since early July, turning the sky brown, creating dangerous driving conditions and delaying some airline flights. August 20th, cloudburst storm kills three in Pittsburgh. Three inches of rain fall in one hour. Roads explode. We were coming down Washington Boulevard, and one part of the road, as I was coming towards Allegheny River Boulevard, um, I saw the, the road just exploded. I mean, the, uh, the concrete flew probably about four or five feet in the air, and then water just started. It was like geysers. And then little mini geysers started popping up all over the place. And we were traveling fine. Water was probably up to the bumpers of some of the smaller cars, but I was in an SUV, so I was like, okay. And then the road just opened up. I mean, just opened up, and a white car sunk. This big red pickup truck went under, and then water started coming in my doors. I called 911. They said try to swim for it. The water by that point was over my head. It started coming in, so I climbed to the roof, and then the car, you know, started going under. August 19th, SUV swallowed in massive Detroit sinkhole. August 18th, high temperatures kill fish in Mustang Bayou. 3,000 fish found dead in Murfreesboro Pond. August 18th, fish kill raises a stink on Pearl River. Masses of dead fish are still surfacing in the Pearl River following a surge of toxic water from a Bogalusa paper mill. The Pearl River, we're actually near the town of uh, Pearl River right now, and you can see uh, just all the dead fish, uh, buffalo fish, catfish, uh, maggots all over them right now. Something that's interesting to point out, uh, the fact I'm being told by uh, scientists with DEQ uh, that this is the lowest uh, level that the river has been uh, in the last 100 years, which makes it a lot more difficult to dilute this chemical. City unable to explain massive fish kill in Gateway Pond. August 18th, poachers may be to blame for Suffolk fish kill. Species such as roach, bream, perch, tench, chub, and pike were among the fatalities, some fish weighing as much as four pounds. August 18th, firefighters checked for plague. Treks fumigated after unusual house call. Waybury firefighters checked an abandoned building recently encountered a small but potentially dead woodly hazard. Fleas. When they came to their engine, they were literally covered in fleas. One of the firefighters said there was literally thousands of them crawling on them. They were taken to the hospital, undressed, scrubbed down, and checked for flea-borne diseases, and the fire truck was fumigated. Morgellons, terrifying to new disease reaching pandemic status. August 20th, car falls into big northwest sinkhole. This is in Chicago. It was a rough morning Saturday for one driver whose car plunged into a sinkhole on Chicago's northwest side. Bugnadoos develop across areas of Missouri. Parts of Missouri affected by serious flooding in recent months are having to contend with bizarre new natural hazard, swarms of bugs that appear in the shape of tornado funnels. This stuff is all around me.
this vertical video work? Or you just gotta flip it in the program. It's like on the road, literally. Like It looks like a tornado so bad. Look at that. They're scared of the tornado. They're running. Oh, it's so thick right now. It's fun. <laughs> I'm glad we came over here. August 17th. More infections from Superbug in Rotterdam. Number of people who have become infected is risen to 98. August 18th. Flash flooding in Berkshire closes roads. Heavy rain has caused flash flooding across Berkshire, causing traffic problems in Reading and Borough of Workingham. August 18th, a hailstorm closes Omaha Airport. Damage reported to planes and cars in the parking lot. August 18th, Lake Somerville losing a half foot of water a week. August 18th, disaster in one of Earth's last cypress stands. Thousands dead fish float in Louisiana. August 19th, flash floods hits Catabato Village, 45 families displaced in the Philippines. August 18th, one man dead after tornado, storm rolls through northern Wisconsin. August 18th, Mosquitoes are now developing a resistance bed nests that have been treated with an insecticide. Health advisory issued for Dexter Reservoir after high levels of algae were found. August 19th, Alaska's mysterious floating orange goo identified as rusting fungal spores, but local Eskimos fear fish will be poison. The mystery of the floating orange goo has been solved, or so they say once again. August 20th, possible toxic algae found at the Warshak Reservoir in Idaho. August 20th, massive algae bloom off New Jersey coast not expected to move in the near future. August 20th, blue-green algae is suspected in several dog deaths in Kansas. August 21st, E. coli contamination brings water crisis to Copenhagen. Parts of the Danish capital were without drinking water Saturday after high levels of the E. coli bacteria were detected in the municipal tap water system. A little-known potentially fatal tropical disease is spreading outside of Latin America. Although there are millions of people with Changas, a disease that kills over 12,000 people a year, little heard of outside of Latin America. However, the tide could be about to turn because cases are growing in the U.S., Europe, Japan, and other wealthy regions drawing attention to the, the disease. August 21st, old disease, EHD, epizootic hemorrhagic disease, is suspected of killing deer again. An old disease is suspected of moving north again to kill New Jersey deer. Talk about being at the right place at the right time. Jerry captured this tornado in Dryden, Ontario as it spun near the airport. And finally, our number one video, Sandra's video of the lightning, the wind, the rain, the crazy amounts of hail. This had our newsroom buzzing. Holy cow <laughs> is right. August 21st, solar wind from double coronal hole on sun should reach Earth August 22nd to 24th. August 21st, Kamachatka's Kiziman volcano shaken by 900 tremors over a 24-hour period. August 22nd, four small earthquakes shake, shake region of Scotland. August 21st, Pakistan flooding, the 2011 sequel. 30 dead, 50,000 ho 50, homeless, 2 million affected. August 21st, severe thunderstorm takes out trees, leaves 10,000 people without power. A powerful storm also swept through Toronto Sunday afternoon, causing flooded roads and downed trees and leaving people without power. 
Sunday's storm started around 2.40 and produced gusts of winds up to 100 kilometers an hour. It drenched parts of the city with more than 40 millimeters of rain in only 10 minutes. August 22nd, heavy rain, damaging winds hit Perth southwest. August 20th, heavy rain, traffic, and low-lying land contributed to the deadly Pittsburgh floods. The flash floods that killed four people and forced others to swim to safety or climb onto their cars was a freak accident caused by heavy rainfall that overwhelmed the sewer system just at rush hour traffic. August 21st, one dead as tornado devastates southwestern Ontario town. Godrich, Ontario, a powerful tornado swept through a southwestern Ontario town on Sunday, killing one person and causing severe devastation in the picturesque community on the shores of Lake Huron. It was the most powerful tornado to hit Ontario in years, officials said. Autumn arrives in August. Leaves are already changing colors thanks to hot, dry spring. Judging by this rich display of russet, gold, and green, you would be forgiven for thinking autumn had it was already well underway. Those balmy weeks combined with the recent rainy weather have brought autumn to the Surrey village of Wisely this August weekend where the apples already look ripe for picking. August 22nd, 11 die in food poisoning in Xinjiang, China. August 22nd, anthrax spreads in Rajshani, Bangladesh. Reaches 109 in Dominican Republic. Here you can see a map of the currently erupting volcanoes around the world. Here's the latest earthquakes that are five and above in the last seven days. 6.2 off the east coast of Honshu, Japan. 6.2 in Fiji region. 6.3 near the east coast of Honshu. 7.1 in Vanuatu, a 7 in Vanuatu, and that seems to be it for the last seven days.